morning and my hair is a little nappy, isn't it? Why do I look so oily? I did a haul recently and I'm trying to put some of the clothes away. I thought these were pajama shorts and apparently they're not. I'm definitely gonna wear them as pajama shorts. I really need to do a closet clean out. We're gonna have to do that one of these days and I'm selling a lot of clothes I haven't worn before or probably worn once or twice on my Poshmark so you guys should check it out. I'm gonna link it down below. Surprisingly, some people are buying things so I'm like, okay. Even things like this, I'm debating to sell it for like, I don't know, five bucks, three bucks. I need hangers. Uh, let's just bring this back. If you guys follow me on TikTok, you guys will know that I built these drawers. So I'm gonna try to bring this in with my broken ankle. Try to organize some things. Start getting our life together. To clean all of this before I even place these drawers against this wall. We gotta move that. I gotta move all that. I have these BTS dolls that I want to donate because I don't use them. These were gifts from my Vancouver meet and greet, I believe. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Or was this from KCON? Look at my painting. Someone painted this for me. This is like my first KCON, I think. I have more painting canvases. It's starting to look better. Okay, let's vacuum this. Look how clean. Excluding everything around, but look at this area. So nice. Maybe if I have a second one here, but it'll block my light switch and I just realized that. Oh no, no, oh no, no. Okay, so we put the drawers together. I think it looks okay at first. I was debating if I wanted to put these two all the way at that corner. Of course, I have to clean out this whole mess, but I wanted close access. Wow, look at a shit room. Wow, a shit room. A shit room for you. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move that rack, clothing rack, which I need to accessorize more, and put it into that corner. Remove that pink rack with the three baskets, give it away, or probably like donate it somewhere and also get it rid of that furry ottoman i don't think i need that in my room there's just no space i need to get a new chair because like how gross i will never go with a white furry chair ever again in my life okay so i decided that these two top drawers are going to be for contacts as you guys seen already i have a bunch of contacts in here which i need to fill this up thank goodness there's room and then there's also a contact drawer in here which hopefully if there's more room i can just keep these top two drawers as contacts and get rid of this one the brand only always send me a lot of contacts so I need to just find a way to manage them and I have these acrylics I'm still debating how I'm gonna stack them up taking the contacts out of their bags So these are the contacts that I'm gonna attempt to organize in here. I'm debating if I really need these dividers or not because I could take them out because I'm wasting so much space with the divider. I probably don't need these. packs are already open and what I'm gonna do is actually organize these individual ones by just taking them out and snapping them. I'm gonna organize these into the main vanity area. So we're just gonna start breaking them all into their individuals or actually you can keep two like this and just bend it over and then I just fit them in like so and then we're gonna have them all organized and cute. There's like no specific way of doing this. I just make sure to utilize as much of the space as I could as possible. Tuck it into the little socket, and there you go. Two pairs of contacts in each. Wow. Dang! Nicely organized. I added some here already. I'm going to have to take all of these. There's some more back here, guys. My favorite, Symphony Green. I realized I have so many of these Spanish lines. Let's just... First tray filled, bunch of the Spanish line. So I put the extra one right here, so it's kind of connected. Vixen is over here. 
do this. I like my contacts to be kind of like all together in categories. Starlight, Scandi, then the Ocean Gold line, Russian Velvet, and this is just a random one. I do have these two left. I'm just gonna probably snug them onto the side. I have like a bunch of these BTS contacts, but the prescriptions are zero. If I wear these, I'll be blind. So I'm debating to just give these away. Then I have this Priority Dry One two and three. Do you see what I mean? Like I rank these with my islands, my symphonies over here, which I should probably squeeze this over here somehow. Starlight and Spanish. So I just have like a bunch of like the same lens. So much for that. I forgot that my sister and I and my family, I don't know who's going, but we're gonna go to a sunflower patch to go take some photos. I have to leave this room looking like this. But on the bright side, we have the drawers in, we got the contacts figured out. I'm gonna go take a photo for Gentle Monster because woo, we're collabing. I'm so excited. I'm super excited because we love Gentle Monster. We got all the YG artists collabing with them. I only have one sunglasses from them and I bought them in Korea. And they're pretty expensive. Clouds there's a castle in the sky And I just want you to take me there And then I'll be Then I'll be with you We're now at the sunflower place Look how pretty these sunflowers are Then I'll Flowers. That's a cute spot. I don't know where to go. Oh, they're so sad. They're facing away from themselves. My sister's taking photos with the old camera I used to film with. She actually bought me this. I haven't used it in so long. It's really good. Faster! Well, you have to stand right here in the a gap opening. But these are the glasses. I took a few photos with it and it turned out pretty good. Is it better with the cardigan? Is this is 360. No. It's just really wide. Go. Wait, how? <laughs> it really zooms out, huh? It's white and gold. Is it one together? No. Oh, do one right here with this. Should I do it here? She's taking a thumbnail. I'm not supposed to get it. I want to vlog my sister's fish that she recently got. His name is George. No, his name is Bob. He matches a George. I really love fish now. Wait, guys, this is not a companionship we're witnessing before us. I want a companion. I'm getting a fish tomorrow. It's like, I picked. I picked this fish, I made this, like, it's my kid. It's like, you get to design this little house. <laughs> It's like, I'm not lonely, I have friends. I can be in my room for more than an hour without feeling depressed. So you want um, a um, ping pong ball? <laughs> ping pong ball? Ping pong ball. I'm getting a fish tomorrow and y'all gonna suck it because my fish is gonna be beautiful, big, and glorious. Mm -hmm. Okay, now that I'm home, I'm wearing my niece's t-shirt. She dyed her hair in this t-shirt, so it looks like I slaughtered a hater. I didn't. It's currently 10. I'm gonna try to get some cleaning done, as you guys can tell. Nothing moved. I'm gonna try my best to just whip everything up and then rest and ice my feet. I'm just gonna wipe down my makeup before I break out even more. So right now, I'm breaking out on my upper lips. And you know when you start feeling like your makeup is oily and it's starting to cake up? You start feeling your pimple grow. Bro. I hate having this feeling of like makeup white residue on. <laughs> I got this shirt from Greece. Like anyone ask. So these are actually my lipsticks that I collabed with Cleo on. It has my signature and the color I picked. I'm actually not going to keep all of these. What I like to do is just have some on hand because I like to give them away whenever I send out packages. For example, if I send these out, then I might pair it up with the lipstick just to show a small token of appreciation. I don't want you to have the wrong idea that I have like all my lipsticks for what reason. I got to choose the packaging, the color, and the holographic design. I'm actually going to keep them out here because they can't really close properly my room is so dusty I feel like I need to wear gloves I 
think I should just mm. throw these away. I feel like these Kylie lippies are all overdue and expired. Yeah. These are my pony ones. I used to love this color from Pony Effect. They're totally done. I know for sure. Oh, so sad. My niece is dancing to JLo outside. My first YSL lipstick I bought myself. Remember the video I did of Jenny's lipsticks? Well, here they are. Okay, let's try to organize this. I just opened up this S4 lip product and it smelled like fish. That's when you know, way overdue. I've had these for so many years now, I can't keep them. Sorry, my ankle. There's a YSL one. It smells fine, but the texture, I don't know if you can tell, the texture just looks chunky. I think this one is still okay. The texture is not chunky. It's a very sheer pink. I'm gonna keep a few of these BT Cosmetic BTS lipsticks or matte lips. Look at all these eye glitters. I gotta throw them all out. Look how the oil separated from the glitter. I'm gonna end the vlog, but before I do, I wanna show you guys the progress that I have achieved so far. It's currently one o'clock, so a couple hours passed by already. I have a list because I have my retainers in already. Okay, so starting off with this drawer, I just have a lot of miscellaneous thing, but in this container, I do have my eye creams. I have some lip products back there and just like so much random shiz. And then I have my pimple acne drawer, which I did not bother to touch or even reorganize. I just know where my acne stuff are, which is great. And then in this drawer, I have all of my cleansers in this bucket and then all my toners surrounding around it. I had to throw so much things out because they were expired. But anyway, these are all the serums. I realize I have so many serums. And back there, if you can see, there are a few amples, but not too many. And then in here, I just have a lot of my essence, face mists, and wait, these are ample too, but whatever. This drawer is like super heavy because all the glass bottles, but okay. In this upper drawer, I put my face masks in and I don't have a lot, which is fine because this is perfect for me because I give a lot of them to my family. So that's totally fine. And then in this drawer, oh, so this is my original blackhead drawer, as you can tell. I didn't bother to touch this either, but when I get to it, I'll sort out blackhead strips that I've already tried and used and then I'm gonna put the newer ones up in here so I'll know what I'm using and what I'm not using when I want to review new blackhead strips and then in this drawer is a little bit more like fun I guess zombie packs modeling masks peel-off masks just more like barduki masks things that I have tried on my channel already then I left this drawer empty because I have a basket over there of products that I have tried already kind of similar to like these things and I'm just gonna have to sort these two drawers out as well and then all these drawers are empty of course except for the contact drawers starting from these bigger drawers if you open the top one ta-da like i have so much space these are more like pore masks clay masks any kind of masks that you wear within like 20 minutes and wash off just kind of like a pamper me kind of section which i gravitate towards more so i put it on the biggest top drawer and then right below it i have some of my night creams and daily moisturizing creams it's also very easy accessible whenever i run out with the creams i have up here which is a mess so don't mind that um i can just easily grab a new one. Oh wait my nail drawer i declare this as my nail drawer because before this the ohoda were living in here Hair and it was just a mess. I'm really happy about this. I'm gonna buy more and stack up, so that'd be nice. I'm gonna actually continue doing what I'm doing, but I'm gonna end the vlog because I know it's gonna be boring to some of you guys. So I hate if you didn't have a good day, you can always make tomorrow better. Good night. Thanks, Jesus. Drink my Jesus.